I'm here in back of the uh, engine compartment here on the new S7 series uh, Super Series combines from Gleaner. Uh, one of the reasons we wanted to capture uh, uh, the engine compartment is to show you our new Tier 4 Interim engine uh, that you see here. It's 8.4 liters and uh, one of the advantages of course that we that the farmer gains out of this besides the fact that this now meets the new emission standards and is the first combine platform uh, in the world right now that is being introduced with tier four uh, interim uh, engines on it uh, is the fact that we are able to deliver more horsepower but at the same time a reduced fuel consumption for our customer and so that's what we were trying to drive for is uh, the the new uh, S7 series uh, features our S67 the S67 has 314 horsepower with a power bulge to 344 horsepower. And the new S77 shown here with its 8.4 liter engine delivers a now a 370 horsepower uh, rated uh, engine horsepower with a power bulge today to 398 horsepower uh, at 1950 RPM. So the big advantage was to uh, reduce the amount of heat. So obviously the cooling requirements on this engine are uh, substantially less than they were on the Tier 3 engine. Uh, you'll see that a very nice compact package. Uh, the engine can sit here in the engine compartment. It gives me full access on the Tier 4 engine. In addition to that, you'll see that we have uh, two uh, mufflers on the engine with the shield around it and one of these obviously is where we deliver the after treatment what we call the uh, diesel exhaust fluid DEF as it's referred to uh, into here uh, is the after treatment to break down the NOx and take those uh, in essence from uh, 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 damaging uh, to, the, uh, to the ozone and the environment and break it down to harmless nitrogen and uh, obviously uh, H2O uh, so in the process of doing this the advantage we have out of here is clean burning air and reduce fuel consumption. Uh, at this point here, I'm going to walk down uh, for a moment here and uh, uh, show you how easy the access is here to the uh, to the uh, tank for the 24-gallon uh, uh, diesel exhaust fluid. I'm just coming down now from the engine compartment, and I'm walking around to the left-hand side of the combine. Uh, and you'll notice here how we make the uh, the diesel exhaust fluid uh, tank. 24 gallon tank here very easily accessible uh, for fill from the ground level and and the uh, rule of thumb here of course is uh, one uh, tank full of, of def for every three tank uh, fulls of uh, diesel fuel again uh, makes it very easy very accessible and the uh, control unit here for the uh, dosing uh, of the uh, uh, the def is located right here again very easily and accessible and yet protected from uh, any environmental issues that we might have so again a very uh, very compact package uh, and again the end result delivering reduced fuel consumption uh, obviously uh, lower uh, heat uh, that we have uh, generated from uh, this engine than we have in the traditional tier th uh, 3 engine and most importantly uh, giving us more productivity and greater capacity.